All right, Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. All right, uh, starting off with your overall energy, unfinished business and here and now. I feel like there is something that is not done and you're kind of feeling stuck. Should I go back? Should I move forward? Should I open this door? Should I keep it shut? I do feel like you want a new beginning here with this person, but you're stuck. I know you're going to yell at me. I don't want them back. I know. I know this. I know. But your energy doesn't say that. <laughs> uh, your person here feels the same way you do. I feel like they want to clean up some kind of a mess and have some kind of peaceful new beginning. I do see eggs everywhere, which is usually a new beginning. All right. Um, the birth of something new. I'm seeing a lot of twos for you guys. Two, 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 two. So look up angel number two, two, two. Um, a triplicate or four of those, whatever. Um, we also have blessed. I feel like this, <coughs> I feel like this connection is blessed, Pisces, but Let's get into it. Let's get into a current situation for Pisces. <laughs> Pisces. This could be a soulmate, an equal exchange of love. What's going on? Current situation for Pisces in love. Oh boy. Keep in mind, Pisces, energies can be reversed and flip-flopped, all right? And if you can, hit that like button for me. And subscribe to my channel. <laughs> All right, we have the Emperor, which is Aries energy. You could be dealing with a fire sign or an Emperor. Could be male or female, no gender in tarot. Um, one of you could be juggling. I feel like it's you, the here and now. Should I? Shouldn't I? Should I give this a chance? Should I go back? Should I not? I feel like you're kind of in that should I energy, that questioning energy. You feel like it's not done, though. You feel like you're not done. All right, let's see. You could even just want closure, all right? That could be what that's all about, you know? Maybe it ended abruptly or you didn't find out the actual full truth or didn't hear it from them. So you just want that closure. That could be what that is too, all right? But let's see. I can't with your energy today, Pisces. The lovers, Gemini energy. The lovers, yes, soulmate energy, love. I choose you. It is a choice in love, okay? Maybe you have options. I don't know. Let's keep going. Let's keep going for Pisces' uh, current situation. Nine of Cups, and then we have Nine of Wands. Somebody could feel kind of wounded. I am. We have Nine Nine here. Um, I feel like there is a wish fulfillment here, but somebody could have their walls up, guard up, because they got hurt. All right. Somebody could be feeling hurt here. Let's get into that. Let's get into blockages and see what happens. What's blocking this connection with Pisces and their person? Somebody could have been a little bit of a player. Not taking this connection or relationship seriously. Um, I have Knight of Wands, which is my player card. Um, Sagittarius energy. It's chasing after passions. I also have five of swords, which could be, you know, fighting, disagreements. Um, I feel I usually take five of swords more as like the inner battle with thoughts, um, but it could be like winning, <clears throat> winning at all costs. There could have been some nasty arguments between you and this person. Maybe you were trying to outsmart them or you are outsmarting them and called them out on their bullshit. Uh, I have Queen of Pentacles here, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, could be dealing with an Earth sign. An Earth sign could have got between the two of you. Somebody's juggling here. It's here twice now. Could be the should I, shouldn't I, will I, won't I, or is it juggling relationships? The star, Aquarius, energy, which is communication. Was communication off? Did you want something that you didn't express or, or you guys were just not on the same page? There's something about lack of communication here or it's being blocked. Somebody could have ghosted or blocked here. A new start in love also being blocked. I feel like this person's trying to come back to you, Pisces, and clean up whatever mess it is that they made. And I feel like you are kind of hanging back. 
and like observing and seeing, you know, does this person's actions ma match their words? Are they going to be truthful? Are they going to give me what, what I want? You know, um, but, so let's see, what are their intentions? What are this person's intentions for Pisces? Intentions. All right, temperance, Sagittarius energy, going with the flow, divine timing, patience. Aquarius energy, your cards keep falling on the map. The Empress, Page of Pentacles, Taurus energy. Yeah. This person, they first of all, they want to be on the same page with you. They want to rebuild or work together as a team. They want to offer you this Page of Pentacles. So there is an offering of stability. So I feel like with this clean it up, it's like, all right, let's, let me offer Pisces this little token of love here, or appreciation or stability, honesty, and let's rebuild. I feel like this person sees you as the empress, male or female. There's no gender in tarot, but they see you as that loving, caring, nurturing Pisces energy that you are, right? Um, I feel like they also see you kind of cold and cut off, though. Like your sword is drawn right now. Your sword is drawn. Because there is a painful ending. So here's where they want to come and clean it up. There could have been backstabbing, betrayal. A painful ending. Now they want to put in the work and effort. This is their intentions. Now, now they want to protect this. Look, Emperor, Empress, divine counterparts, long-term commitment, relationship, forever, meant to be. Now they want to protect this. I feel like before they weren't protecting this connection, and I feel like they were kind of playing loose, you know, and not taking it seriously. But now they want to. Now they're changing their tune. Let's see, how do they feel about Pisces? What are their emotions towards Pisces? How do they feel? Four of Wands. Queen of Cups, that's you. So Four of Wands, the 1111 make a wish, twin flame soulmate, leveling up, house, home, commitment. So next level, they wanna next level this. I have the Hermit here, which is Virgo energy. I, I feel like you may have blocked them or cut off communication. Hold your energy back. This could also be them awakening to this connection as well, Pisces. Let's see. First one. All right, how do they feel about Pisces? How do they feel about Pisces? How do they feel? <laughs> Ooh, they're yeah they're they're trying to manifest you i know you can't really manifest a person unless they're aligning and manifesting you and you guys are vibing at the same level you know i feel like they're they're trying though they're trying to manifest you i feel like they're using all the tools in their toolbox to try and fix this and clean this mess up they feel like you're waiting though Page of Swords. You're waiting for answers. They want to reconcile. They want judgment. Scorpionic energy. Ace of Wands. They want a passionate new beginning. You could be watching them online or they're watching you online, observing. I don't, I'm not gonna say stalker, but they're they're paying attention, and I feel like you might be too. Trying to decide, but they know that you're you're holding back. You're waiting. There is a judgment call being made here, or this is reconciling this together. They're attracted to you, Pisces. They want this like passionate new beginning or reigniting this flame, trying to follow their intuition with it. What is this judgment? Is this reconciliation? Yeah, healing, four of swords. They want to heal this and reconcile this. Yep. 
What are you going to do, Pisces? What are you going to do? Let's see. Keep in mind, you have free will. So do they. So it can change the outcome of this. This is just a potential outcome. What's Pisces going to do? And I'm not here to tell you what to do. All right, Ten of Wands, putting that burden down, but how? Closing out a cycle. Some of you could live at a distance. Maybe you're moving. The wheel in reverse. Are you not moving forward? What's Pisces going to do here with this person? Pricey is going to do. Don't be pulling the moon on me there, Pisces. Mm -mm. You are going to come out of hermit mode. You are going to come out of hermit mode. So then what? Maybe you'll meet him for some drinks or at a party. Some kind of celebration. You might just randomly bump into them. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. There's going to be an apology about whatever this was. Lying, sneaking, cheating, stealing, feeling stuck, trapped, bound, hands are tied, brokenhearted, disappointed. There's going to be an apology. I, I don't know if you're going to randomly bump into this person or if you're intentionally going to come out of hermit mode. Leo energy, the sun. The sun will come out tomorrow. I think you're going to give it another go, but you're going to be firm this time. You're going to be standing your ground. You're going to be, you're being a little bit stubborn, which is good. Uh, you know, I feel like this person, if you just open, because you, you need the truth before you do anything. You need that truth. If you just run right back to them, open, open arms, I don't think things are going to change. So you're being smart and you are being strategic about this. And you want the truth. And that truth could just be closure. And then you'll move on your merry way, you know. But then Ace of Wands came out. So I feel like mm, you might reignite that flame a little bit here. And the sun. I feel like you are going to end up being happy with this decision here, Pisces. As long as they come to you correct, and it looks like they're going to. If you're resonating with this, it looks like they're going to. All right, obstacles, awareness. I feel like this person woke up to what this connection is. Yep, thunderbolt. That's that tower moment. So obstacles and change. See? The obstacles here is this person waking up after this tower moment, after things came crashing down, and being open to change and changing their ways here a little bit. Or a lot bit, depending on the, the level here. But I, there's a yin-yang sign here. I feel like there will be balance. I feel like this will flow for you. All right, let's see advice for Pisces. It's actually a really good reading. I haven't had one of these readings for you guys in a while. So it's good. I'm happy for you. All right, hidden path, detour, slow down, explore. Some of you might go in a new direction, like I said. Or this could go in a new direction. Union, reconciliation, eternal love. Your time has come. Hesitation, that's you. That is you. Hesitation, past heartbreak, broken trust, afraid to move forward, fall. Changes in the air. I'm telling you, a big change is happening. And healing, self-care, time out. Be gentle with yourself and your twin. This is This could be healed. I feel like they're going to chase you now because you're not just come back to me. Love me. You're, you're being firm, standing your ground, which is good. And I feel like now they're going to chase you. <laughs> I don't know if you want that. I don't know. It, maybe it'll feel good that they're chasing you. I don't know. All right, let's see. What does this person want to say to you, Pisces? What do they want to say? I 
I'm grateful for the spiritual lesson. They've learned. You taught them the lesson. You may have learned a lesson as well. So this could have been like a karmic cycle that's being closed out. I am becoming a better person. My life is not as together as it seems. I look for you everywhere. See, I don't know if... I feel like this person's gonna... Like, they're watching you. They know, like, some event is coming up. And I feel like they're gonna try and be there to, like, bump into you on purpose. <laughs> you know? Because they're... It's like they're too afraid to, like, call you. Or get in touch with you. Or you blocked them and they can't. So I feel like they're intentionally gonna try and bump into you. Anyway... All right, let's see. Letters could be first, middle, last name, initials. Could spell a name, could spell a word of significance. Place it where you see fit. And I pick as many as my intentions tell me to. I have H, M, X, O, B, N, R, L, P, Q, W. All right, numbers could be birthday, anniversary, number of days, weeks, months, years. Angel numbers, place it where you see fit, whatever it means to you, all right? We have one, four, four, angel number four, four, and 12, and one, so 11, 44, 12, 12, and nine. All right, so one, four, nine, 12. So it could be the first, 14th, 19th, 12th of any month, could be January, April, September or December. Zodiac signs uh, could be their sun sign, strong placements in their chart. Something could happen during that season, like Pisces season. All right, we have Aquarius, Cancer, Aries and Aries, and Pisces. So Pisces, Aries, Aquarius, and Cancer. Could be any sign, you guys. Other, A lot of other signs did show up, so uh, place it where you see fit. But uh, Pisces, that is what I have for you.